This segment brought to you by the Western Kansas Wildlife Travel Center in Oakley. What is a playa, you might ask? Well, you might not ask, so I'm just going to go ahead and tell you. A playa is a fancy name for a mud hole or depression, like a buffalo wallow in the land that naturally collects water when it rains. And these are very important to the wildlife populations. So this next film comes from the Kansas Department of Wildlife, Parks, and Tourism, and it's all about the significance of the playa, how you can create one, and maybe why you should. And it's, uh, I think, pretty darn interesting. Well, I raise uh, mama cows mainly and uh, sell off the calf crop. Um, raise quite a bit of alfalfa, wheat, corn, milo, uh, just about whatever I can get to grow or, or maybe try to grow anyway. Really, there's only the one major playa and uh, I think that the playa probably is less than 40 acres. The playa is hard to farm. Uh, you might get one out of six years where you could grow a good crop, but the, the clay soil in the bottom is uh, kind of prohibitive to, to farming it. So I think it's a waste of time to farm them. Uh, might as well do something else. I've always been a fan of wildlife and enjoyed hunting, and, and I have family that likes to hunt. Uh, well, one way that you can improve your hunting is by creating environment for your wildlife. You know, the playa, it attracts wildlife. If your playa is surrounded by grain fields, you've got a food source. Even in the drought years when there's hardly any water, if it rains and you get an inch rain, which is not uncommon, or two inch rain, you're going to have water in that playa. And that's going to keep wildlife attracted and they keep coming back because they want to check it out and you see all sorts of wildlife um, from upland wildlife to the deer and antelope we get cranes we get ducks we get geese coming in there everything frequents that place and i think sometimes even if it's uh, if there's no water they use it for a, a source to uh, habitate you know out of the weather out of the wind. It's going to be in a, in a wetland reserve easement uh, and it'll be a perpetual. NRCS is real good about helping you and those those guys want you to get everything you need so it's a good deal. If the landowners and the, and the neighbors and uh, the people who have play lakes uh, on their property um, if, if they could check into it I think they'd find out it might be a real good program. to the Western Kansas Wildlife Travel Center right here in my hometown of Oakley, Kansas. We're the front door of Western Kansas, located on three main highways, I-70, US-83, and US-40. And all those roads lead to history, beautiful scenery, and adventure, no matter which direction you go. We now have an IHOP that brand that you've trusted up and down the road in all your travels is staffed with local folks, real people, just like you and me, and we're waiting on you to join us. So for fun, adventure, fuel up, fuel your body, and let's have some fun. <laughs> 